red one. And today I'm going to read a story. The title of this story is The Five Brothers. Long ago in China, there were five brothers who look exactly alike. The only way to tell them apart was by their amazing abilities. First brother was as strong as ten water buffalo. Second brother could fly in the sky like a bird. Third brother could hear an ant sneeze. Fourth brother could make his body iron hard. Fifth brother could hold his breath for hours. Fifth brother had another ability that how that happened when he cried his tear flows so so quickly that they turn into a river one day fifth brother came across a strange garden he decided to rest and enjoy a delicious apple suddenly three soldier appeared and says and sees him this garden belonged to the magistrate. No one may eat his fruit, a shoulder, a shoulder shouted. They dragged fifth brother to the court of the magistrate. Arranged, the magistrate declared the fifth brother should be locked away forever in his, in his deepest dungeon. Please take pity, magistrate. Fifth brother begged, I don't know if I was his young, it was your garden. I didn't know there was any warning sign to stay out of the garden. Please, I would do anything to stay free. The magistrate was an evil, greedy man. He announced his decision. I will let you go. Fifth brother interrupted him. Him with joy. With a shout of joy, the magistrate continued, I will let you go if you bring me the treasure of, of Fire Island. Fifth brother sighed deeply. Fire Island was in the middle of nearby lake. A dragon lived there, guarding its treasure, sealing it seemed like an impossible task. But Fifth Brother agreed to try. That night, as he sat in his prison cell, Fifth Brother felt frightened. He dared not cry, for he knew what would happen if he did. Instead, he whispered, Third Brother. Help me! For a while, third brother put a hand to his ear. Fifth brother is in trouble, he declared after listening to fifth brother's story. Third brother told his other brother what he ha what had happened. They decided to go help their brother get the treasure. Brother used his ability to fly to bring the brother to Fire Island. They all hid out of sight. Then second brother flew to the magistrate's dungeon. He whispered the brother's plan to fit brother through a window. In the morning, the magistrate brought fit brother to the edge of the lake. We'll be watching you like a hawk warned the magistrate don't try to run away fifth brother took a deep breath and dove into the water he remained underwater while his brother worked to get the treasure and fifth brother should have appeared on the shore fourth brother came out of his hiding place he waved at the magistrate from the beach then he looked for the dragon the dragon raced out of his den, blowing a stream of fire breathe at front brother. However, the fire had no effect on his iron heart body.
Papa laughed as he laid the dragon on a track around the island. Finally, poor brother hid behind a rock. Next, first brother jumped down. He used his power of amazing strength to lift the dragon and throw it very far. First brother gathered up the dragon treasure and dove into the lake. Underwater, he handed he handed the treasure to fifth brother who had been holding his bread all along. Fifth brother swam back to the magistrate went and dropped the treasure at his feet. Here is your treasure. Now, fifth brother painted. greedy maid and had another idea. I can never lose a citizen with such amazing power. You must stay with me forever, he declared. When Fifth Brother heard this, he started to Crying, the first tear that hit the ground became a puddle. The second tear turned the puddle into a pond. Before long, his tear became a rushing river that swept the magistrate away. Once the land dried down, the brother journeyed home. They were happy to be together. Again, the next day, his brother announced that he was going on a walk. His brother made him a promise never to eat out of the strange gardens again. Well, the main purpose of this book is, I shall read about a story of a group of brothers who work together against a magistrate. B, to tell a reader about China, its garden, and this ruler, D to tell readers to not eat from strange garden. D to tell readers to take a trip to the garden in China. I should see which bed describes the magistrate. A angry, B selfish, C lazy, D caring. I should see. I should see. Who is the main character in the story? A the dragon, B fifth brother, C the magistrate, D the soldier, and choose B. What is the main problem in this story? A a brother has to travel to a strange land. B a brother has man, has to make a plan for how to use his power. Yeah. I, a brother, is locked up for eating from a garden that does not belong to him. B, D, a brother cannot find the treasure he wants it. I should see. Which brother helped to get rid of the dragon? I, third and fourth. B, second and fifth. C, first and fifth. D, first and fourth. I should see. How does Fifth Brother remain under one while his brother gets the treasure? I think Brother has the ability to hold his breath for hours. B. The other brother keep trading spot with Fibra so he can come up for air. C. 
See, Fifth Brother is able to turn into a fish once he is underwater. Then the other brother gives him special power to stay underwater. I should say, what happens to the, ma to the magistrate at the end of the story? I, the magistrate, is tricked by the brother and jump in a river. B, the magistrate, is swept away in a river formed by Fifth Brother's tears. C, the magistrate falls into a pond and can't get out. D, the magistrate leaves when the brother starts to cry. I should be. What is something all five brothers have in common? A. They all have many powers. B. They all have the same power. C. They all look alike. D. They all eat from the garden. I should see. After Fifth Brother dropped the treasure at the magistrate's feet, the magistrate I sent the sword to get the brother, the other brothers. B. Thanks, Fifth Brother, for the treasure. C. Free Fifth Brother from the dungeon. D. Tell Fifth Brother to stay here with him forever. I should see how the reader know that the magistrate has been tricked. I. Because the magistrate wants Fifth Brother to get the treasure guarded by a dragon. B. Because the magistrate brings Fifth Brother to the lake himself. C. Because the magistrate thinks that Fifth Brother has many amazing power. D. That because the magistrate looks at Fifth Brother. I his I. You did it. You passed. Click on the items with the red X and find a better answer to improve your score and earn more stars. Use the book as you take the quiz to help you find. The click done. I got ten of. I got nine. I got eight of ten. Correct. The end. Thank you.